This might sound weird, but the best in the squad has the pull. Not the pokey stabby pull, but the healing pull. That's right, the cleric is the most valuable unit on your team. Welcome to a sick guide to clerics. The cleric is the so-called support that no one wants to use because they have self-sustaining units or they use dancey flancy dancers, you know? But, well, think again, moron. The cleric is the support who bought a gun after being too fed up with the stupid people they have to heal who takes lots of unnecessary damage. Like, people trash talk them just because they see the stupid same build over and over again or people think they can't hold themselves accountable in battle. You Well, you're also wrong there, buddy. Are you the kind of guy who uses glass cannons and if they accidentally take a hit, you freak out? Or the kind of guy that wants his units to be at max HP because you feel bad for them taking hints. Well, look no further. Get ready to sell an arm and a leg to the almighty cleric of your choice. You could be a fag and choose Veronica, but fuck her. By watching this video, you have sold sold your soul to me and the ever-growing army of Sears. <laughs> but in actuality, use who you want because either way, they can't hit back on a counterattack. So grab your favorite rifle, trap, Baldy or stoner, and let's get rockin' and rollin'. First step of building these monsters is to give them every staff, heal, and special they can get. But in actuality, you just give them the so desired staff of your choice, and refine it in the opposite of your B skill. So if you have Wrath or Staff, choose the uh, Dazzling Staff upgrade, and vice versa. But no pain, fuck pain, and double savage flow. God, I hate them. Next is to grab yourself a beautiful bond, a solo skill. If you're a cheapskate and don't want to sell your organs for them, a simple stat boosting skill like speed or attack 3 will suffice, or even HP or defense depending on your so desired build. And then you put the raffle or dazzle, rings of mercy, depending on how you so want, but that's only if you want to have a stupid pain dazzle and have double savage blow and rings of mercy and maybe uh, like a bond of, of HP. But fuck that build. You want the beautiful raffle dazzle combination. Then you put a wave, a hone for a tactic, or whatever you want on said unit. I like speeds myself or like the hones for. If you can get the hone for. Ugh. But yeah, I like the speeds, if you can get the speeds, or even like a ploy, since m majority of them have nice res. Then, you slap a seal on that beautiful butt of theirs. Pre preferably a bond if you have a bond in A, or just a bond because bonds are amazing on clerics. I wish I had that, that speed bond right now, but I will. Hehe. <laughs> or just, just use a brazen. Because brazens are pretty good, because if they accidentally take a hit, or they tank a hit somehow, well, then they're in nice brazen lanes, because of the, they're also good. Or if you still a cheapskate, you can put another stat booster, but who wants to be a cheapskate and put stat boosters on their clicks? You gotta have the beautiful, expensive builds to show off how much you love your beautiful cleric. No one cares about the time. Now, enjoy the monster you just created and watch them wreak havoc on everything they encounter. Ha ha ha.